Hello, my name's Bev, and three years ago I took up playing the recorder again after a 50 year gap. Hello, it's me, and a box has just arrived in the post, and I'll just go and get it and show you what's inside. Okay, it's come all the way from Germany um, and recorder players among you will probably realise that you can get recorders from these people. Toman? Is it pronounced Toman? Thoman? Toman? Anyway, it's... Um, we shall see what's in the box. What's in the box? Right. Okay, here goes. Oh, a lot of packaging. As you would expect. Right. Packaging. Let me just adjust the camera so hopefully you can see a bit more of me. We got more. <laughs> it's less of me and more of a box. Right. The box. Ooh. Inside the box, it's like past the parcel, isn't it? Right. I'll just open this. Oh, 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 I'm so excited. I am excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. I am excited. And we have a lovely case. The kind of case you might expect to have a flute or an oboe in, but this isn't. As you can see, it's a Mollenhauer, which will give you a clue as to what's inside. Um, right, you can't see, can you? Let me have a look. Let me put that right down there so you can see. I am opening the box. <gasps> look what's inside. Look what's inside. It is, and I'm quite surprised actually, it is a Mollenhauer modern or modern recorder, state of the art, it's supposed to be able to play through three octaves quite comfortably. Um, I'm quite surprised at the can you see it? The finish, actually, because it is, it is um, palisander wood. And by way of comparison, I'll just get it. This is my palisander Moek Rottenberg Alto recorder. Um, and as you can see, the colour is quite different. I expected it to be more like this, but I guess colour isn't everything. Um, what this doesn't come with is a cleaning kit which came with my Moek wooden recorders. One of these cleaning kits that contains a brush and oil and bits and pieces. It doesn't come with that which is you would expect it to, considering how much it cost. It cost quite a bit. Anyway, another thing I'm not keen on are these sort of gold. This is the E key, um, which helps you play in different registers. And I think it goes goes down to E. Um, it's an alto recorder, which traditionally would only go down to F and I do believe this means that it goes down to E, but I have to see, I don't like that cheapo gold finish. I know Moex version of the modern recorder, it's not called modern, it's called something else, um, has the silver keys, which I think are more, um, I, I prefer the silver keys. These, I don't know. Anyway, let's not get carried away by the keys. What we do have is cleaning rod. We've got um, 
modern you can't see that because it's in mirror writing it says mod, modern harmonic recorders and we've got a guarantee we've got a fingering chart and um obviously we've got some grease um and that's all um nice finish all sorts of plush kind of velvety um but anyway let's have a look let's put it together right hmm. as you can see that is quite similar shape to this is a, a mollenhauer um soprano recorder that we have and um color is quite similar actually but again it's got that flat joint there um right obviously with a wooden recorder you have to play it in you can't suddenly go and play a whole sonata in one go you've got to play it in in increments um so i am hoping that this will be the most amazing recorder i've ever bought and if it isn't i shall be extremely disappointed but they do have a a money back guarantee um at Tomman or Thoman or whatever it's however it's pronounced um though i imagine sending it back to germany isn't as easy as it would be sending it to a uk shop um i bought it from germany because it was actually cheaper than shops over here in the uk and i have bought recorders through um Tomman before um anyway let's have a look at this let's um put the case to one side and let's have a look let's have a look and see what it can do Ooh, not very good start let's try Mm, I can't really play it yet because, um, well, I have to, obviously I have to um, play it in, but also my son's on nights, so I really don't want to be making a lot of noise. Um, so maybe I'll do another video about um, playing it. Um, but what are my initial impressions out of the box? Um, I don't know. Am I a bit disappointed? Um, why am I a bit disappointed? I think it's the wood. Um, I expected something a bit more luxurious, a bit more like the the Moek Palisinda, which has a lovely, lovely finish and a lovely sheen. Um. <coughs> this I don't know yeah um maybe that's because it is a modern recorder um it remains to be seen how it how it plays and um as I said I'll do another video on that um yeah until I played it I can't really comment out of the box though um like i said not keen on the gold keys and expected a bit more of a dark luxurious finish so oh and also it would have been nice at the price i paid for it um for it to come with a an oiling kit like a maintenance kit like the um, Moex do uh, that would have been been nice how much did I pay for it um, quite a lot and I've yet to see whether it's worth it or not so watch this space <laughs> 